Last week I lost one of my closest friends. It's a beautiful Tasmanian devil called Kindred and yeah. it's not easy working with a Tasmanian devil because they have such short lifespans. Kindred was one that I looked after. I started hand raising her in 2003 and there's a documentary made sometimes some of you guys might have seen it on Animal Planet called Devil's Diary and I had her and her sister it was Kindred and Medina and they're both beautiful devils out of all the animals I've worked with Tasmanian devils are the most intelligent and the most affectionate. There's no animal more affectionate than a Tasmanian devil. <clears throat> I had some wonderful times with Kindred. She would often growl when I pick her up, but with devils that's often a sign of excitement. She's just, you know, usually pleased to see me. Uh, she would just hang around my sh feet and just, you know, wouldn't leave me alone until I did pick her up. She loved her cuddles. She was a friend and a companion for these six or so years. It's... It is difficult working with an animal that has only a lifespan of five to six years. <clears throat> and <clears throat> I'm going to miss her. I love that girl. <clears throat>